What is going on guys? This is just a quick tutorial from FMU, that's me, <laughs> showing you how to download and install the in-game editor. Uh, it's different to the pre-game editor as you have to go into the actual game and go to downloads. Click on that and it will bring up this little picture here. Now you can see I've already purchased it but um, if you click on there it will give you the option to purchase. You'll click that and then you can purchase it via your cart. Uh, you have to add the money, obviously it's $4.99 uh, without it. Now I, yep, we'll close that. Let me see, what have I got on here? Have I got, uh, what's this one? Hide, I'm not using this one anymore, so we'll go into this one. Ooh. So I don't really use the editor other than to change names and kits. That's what I brought it for because I like to sometimes when I'm watching a 3D game, uh, if I can't download 3D kits for teams, I like to sometimes change the kit design of the team that I'm managing and all that sort of jazz. So, okay, we'll go in here to hide and you'll see here it says FM in-game editor so you can change the club's details if you wish to you can change their finances their status their sugar daddy status as well facilities you can change the name of the ground which is something that I often use it for because of the simple fact that if you were uh, get a new stadium and you had a player called I don't know Kent boob face and they named it the boob face state the kemp boob face stadium some people might want to keep it but uh, i wouldn't so i would change the name in there um you can add a roof under soil heating if you wish uh you can also which is pretty cool add uh rivalries as well which i think is brilliant and favorite people and dislike people so that you know that's what I use it for to change the name of the stadium and you know when you get that regen who's uh, pale as anything ginger as anything and he's from Nigeria and his name is uh, I don't know Babu Babupa Undiwara or something like that it just doesn't fit so um, you can go in and you can change the name uh, if you go into the player you can change all sorts of things um, which I don't really ever mess around with but like I say if you do want to change the players personal details you can change his name uh, what he's known as if he's declared for a nation if he's retired you can change his in-game hair color and skin tone it doesn't change his regen or new gen picture or anything like that you can change favorite people you know favorite club same sort of stuff and uh, you can also you know add another nationality and stuff like that so it's pretty cool you know it's pretty cool for those who like to change players names and stuff of course it's there for those who like to cheat and you know add money to the club and and stuff like that but uh, yeah I'm very open and very honest I will tell people when I've used it and what I've used it for and it is always to either change the name of the player the stadium or in the past when I've been doing a level 10 to the Prem series I've used it to decrease the balance at the club to make it more realistic because I was getting too much money but that's it guys it's so simple and so easy so um, that's how you install the in-game editor Hope that's been helpful and I will see you all next time. Goodbye.